Okay, uh, hello YouTubers again. First dig today. Um, and you can see the bottom of the hole there. Coin, I think it's just a penny, but it's a good depth, it's around about 9 10 inches deep. Plus, you've got about an inch off the floor with the detector. So, you've got about 11 inches it's detected at, which is a, a good depth. I'll get it out and we'll have a look. Let's have a look. Yeah. What is it? George 6. Let me get you a date for you. Let's see if we can get you a date. Nineteen... Oh, sorry. I'll get it for you in a minute. Nineteen... Forty-seven. Coin there. Nineteen forty-seven. George six. Nice patina on it. I see it very well in this camera. There we go. Nineteen forty-seven. George six penny. About nine inches, ten inches down. Okay, get back if I get something else. Right. Well, day's getting better. Uh, a lot better. Uh, I knew this field had potential, and I've had a couple of avid coins out of here in the past. Um, but I thought I'd pretty much done this field, but uh, I was wrong. There we go. There's a lovely little hammer coin just there. I'm going to pick it up now. Have a look at it. It's a long cross. Oh, and it's in good nick. It is in good nick. I don't know if you can see that, guys. Um, it looks like it might even be King John, one of our first Plantagenet kings. Might not be. But uh, so I'll clean it up. I'll get back to you on the roundup, and uh, we'll have a good look, see what it is. But yeah, hammered coin. Get in. Day's getting better. As Deep Digger Dan would say, get in. Yeah. I've had a few off here, I say two or three off here in the past, but I thought I'd done it all, but there you go. Just goes to show you, going a little bit slower, very deliberate, and you can get them. They're out there, guys, in the fields. Go get them. Right, I'll get back to you. Find. Okay, guys, next find. Nice little D buckle there. Came out around about, I don't know, how deep is that? Where am I? Fade of mine is about there, so we're talking about about nine, ten inches down. Lovely signal. Okay. Lovely. Get back to you if I find something else. Okay. Hello again, everybody. Uh, don't know about this one. Looks very much like it's well, it's definitely lead. It looks like it's like a bullet. Right shape, Ugh. but uh, hmm, hollow there. Don't know. Got some weight to it. Could be. Could be a very old bullet. I'm not sure. Somebody else might know what it is if they do. Feel free to let me know, but uh, yeah. 
Hmm. Okay, probably about six inches down. Gave a banging signal, as it would. Okay, I'll get back to you. Uh, right, okay, YouTubers. Um, this is a good day. Uh, I've got a tiniest little hammered coin here. If you can make it out very well on this camera, guys, but there we are. Um, tiny, tiny, tiny little hammered coin. It's, it's complete. It is. Hang on, I'll turn it over for you so you can have a look. It is a long cross. Long cross. This is light for you so you can see it better. There we go. It's a long cross penny. Short. Um, Sir Hammered Coin. Uh, there we are. Tiny. But uh, yeah, I ain't got a very good camera for this, guys. Sorry, but there we are. Yeah, another Hammered Coin. Marvelous. Well happy with that. Right, carry on. Okay. Hello again everybody. Found this key. Now, it's a very nice key actually. I mean it's a key, it's just a key isn't it, but it's got a very good pattern on it. A very nice pattern. But on this side, you can see it probably here, but it's got a serial number. And I believe it says four seven seven five one one. Yeah, a nice pattern. Some writing around the edge, but I just I can't see it. I can't see what it says at the moment. I think it says Bedford. Don't know. Can't read it all. I'll let you know later. Come out of that hole down there. Around about eight inches deep. Yeah, okay. Get back to you soon.